Hey, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Dobson. This is episode 5 of the BGM Mode Commentaries. Yes, I had to start over, but I've basically replicated my whole team from what it was before. Um, I just couldn't open up the file. I did a disk cleanup or whatever you call it on my X Xbox hard drive, and um, I couldn't open up the file for some reason. It was kind of weird. I could open up my like Pittsburgh one, stuff like that, but not that one, so... I had to start over, unfortunately. Um, not too many changes. I think the only change was Thomas Vanek. Uh, for Johan Franzen, some pick. And I'm pretty sure Mike Samuelson. I don't even think I threw in a pick. I think it was just straight up those two. So that's the only uh, change forward-wise. My defense, of course, a lot different. I have Adam Larson, Zach Bogosian. I think it's for the better because Dougie Hamilton, yeah, he'll turn out to be something. But um, Adam Larson and Zach Bogosian will develop a lot faster than uh, Dougie Hamilton. So I think that was a better change uh, defensively-wise. And uh, Jimmy Howard's still in the net. So um, that were, those were the only changes. But uh, before I get the simulating started, um, I want to get two trades out of the way. I know. I'm sorry, guys. I've been keeping you guys waiting for a long time. But I want to get this rebuild done so we can get going. But um, I had to fill out the third line center. I want a good face-off rating. And I put that in my surplus. And I'll show you guys uh, quick right now what I'm talking about. I went to the trading block. And I believe I went for a sec yeah, second line forward. With a good face-off rating, 17 to 33 years of age. And um, these are my recommend... No, wrong button. What was it? I think it was... Yeah, search list. Here we go. Okay, who was it? So we got a whole bunch of people. Um, it was a lot different before. I don't know why it's like this now. But um, uh, if I could find Zajac, I just got to put in the face-off rating. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Face-offs. There we go, and we'll just put it to four stars. And this is what I got. Let's search it. Yeah, here it is. James Neal, David Backus, Travis Zajac, and Dustin Brown, and Alexander Seven. I'll take a look at Backus real quick. Um, he's not bad. He's one year older. Uh, he's a power forward. I have enough of those on my team, so I'm going for Travis Zajac. He's a very good face-off rating, so I'm uh, definitely going for him. Fills up my third line center because I already have Henrik Zetterberg. So let's go make the trade right now. Um, where are we? Here we. There we go. New Jersey. Um, Zajac, and I'm gonna give up. Hmm. Who do I want to give up for Zajac? Let's go with some rookie skaters. Why not? Let's take a look what they want. Uh, these guys aren't going anywhere. Uh, definitely not touching those. I could give up Yurko and Backman. That wouldn't be too bad. Let's take a look at Yurko. Three stars. He's not going to fit in my team. I have enough snipers. Uh, Yurko is so nasty in real life. Um, he's definitely going to be a, a really good player in real life. But I'm going to have to give you up, man. I'm sorry. I have to get my third line center filled out for this series. And I'm going to give a Backman. Let's take a look at Backman real quick. Um, I don't know what's so special about that. I mean, you know... Uh, three and a half stars is not bad. He'll be a top six, but I mean, I already have that, so I'm willing to give that up. So I'll give up Yurko and Backman, and I'll probably, go, yeah, I'll definitely go through. So I'm probably gonna get some, uh, was it draft picks? So let's go take a look. Um, let's go for a third round. Let's go for two thirds and see if we can get that. So two thirds Zajac for Yurko and Backman will go through. No, not. No, it will not. So let's go for uh, two fours. How about that? Will that go through? Nope. How about that? All right. So that's pretty good. Um, it'll contribute to their success, which I highly doubt. Um, they definitely need a rebuild as well. But uh, let's just go assistant coach, best roster. We won't worry about the roster just yet. And I want to go to Vancouver. Let's see. Who do I want from Vancouver? Oh, that's right. Um, where are you, David? There we go, David Booth. Uh, his contract's a bit, but I'm fine with that. So we'll get David Booth, and I believe it was oh, I can't even remember. Um, was it Burroughs or I'm pretty sure it's Burroughs. Let me take a look. Yeah, Alexander Burroughs. Um, 31 years old, two way forward, but um, I got this all covered. Let's take a look here. Um, where are you? There we go, Cleary. Uh, Cleary's like the exact same thing. Uh, second line, uh, he's just two years younger, and I've played GM modes before, and Cleary uh, retires at this age, if not the next year, so I'm willing to give up Cleary for uh, Burroughs, and we'll give up, um, see what they want in return. 
Yeah, we'll give up Holmstrom. Why not? I need Holmstrom off my team. 39 years old. Get it out of here. <laughs> but um, let's go back to forwards. There we go. Let's see who can give up. Uh, Nyquist is definitely staying. You're not going anywhere. Don't worry. Uh, can give up. Mm, we can give Bertuzzi. Yeah, there we go. All right, so Bertuzzi. Um, I'll throw in a pick. Why not? I got New Jersey's third of um, the Adam Larson trade. So I, pff, I don't know who I should give this. Pick. I'll give it this pick. Why not? So Danny Cleary, Thomas, Thomas Holmstrom, <laughs> Tomas. Uh, Todd Bertuzzi and a third round pick for Booth and Burroughs. I think this will be really good. We'll go through. Ah, no, not quite, not quite. Um, I really want Bertuzzi off my team, so I'm willing to throw in another pick if that's the case. Nope. Ah, jeez. Because I just don't want to give him for strip for a pick, you know, so. um, Don't want to give up my top six. I'll give up Fournier, why not? All right, there we go. So I think that was pretty good. I dumped all my old players, uh, some old contracts too. Um, but we'll go best lines here. And uh, let's get the simulating started. Let's just get the lines going first. Um, I'll probably cut it here and there so you guys don't have to watch me doing this. But uh, just in case, I'll record in case I change my mind. We'll have Zetterberg and Duchesne there. We'll have Zajac on the third line. Philp on the second Landskog Booth. Um, we're okay. We gotta scratch Eves for uh, what's his face Nyquist. There we go. Uh, where are you, Eves? Scratch. All right. No, Burrows, you stay up there. Advocator Helm. All right, that looks good. That looks good. Uh, Eric Johnson over here. We have Al Mars up on the first. Bogosian White down here. Um, all right, I'm probably gonna cut it here, guys. So just let me do the lines, and I'll be back. All right, so I'm back, guys. Uh, yeah, I just got all the lines changed. You guys probably don't even want to check because I just want to get right into the simulation. But uh, here's the lines quick. You guys can pause if you want. I'm not gonna go through. I'm not gonna waste you guys time because you guys have been through this already. But I do apologize. But there's the lineups, boys. Let's get started here. Um, we we'll go up to November 2012. Let's go here. Oh, did I turn off um, injuries? One sec. No, no, no. Come on, stop, please. <laughs> oh, uh, that's not good. Come on. Can I please? Can I stop? It's not letting me stop. Well, this like I'm clicking Y here. Like I hear everyone's having the same problem with the simulating, and like PS3 is really bad apparently, and we're off to a fucking terrible start so um usually it's good but uh not right now not right now um should i make any line changes that's what i'm thinking huh um wow i don't know come want to move booth up here and um yeah we'll try that why not why not? Why not? But um, this is a rebuilding year, so I'm not expecting a Stanley Cup like contending team. But uh, I do expect to do you know fairly well. So I just want to turn off all the injuries and we'll get started. Um, settings, rules, injuries. Oh, okay, they're already off. So I just made a big deal of nothing. Um, all right, so we'll go go to November around uh, mid-November and see how we do um, we're compliant there we go uh, waivers yep and then that's another thing waivers are crazy in this game I was playing just uh, my normal GM and I picked up Mike Richards off of waivers like that's just insane they have to fix that definitely and we get a first win there we go three to two uh, so Nyquist got a goal there I'm liking that um, Phil Plow with assist I believe I put him on the third line I can't remember but whatever um, there's another win that's very nice. Uh, Zajac's doing work on that third line, getting some depth scoring. There we go. There's another win. So um, I th we're doing actually pretty good. Um, good start. S can we beat Chicago? I don't think we can. Nope. Uh, it's just the way the simulation goes. Um, come on, another loss. Really, Vancouver Canucks, bis in our our ass. We got we got fucked over there. 
Uh, obviously, we beat Columbus. Um, come on. Come on, another win. There we go. 4 nothing. Shout out for Jimmy. And that's another thing. I just got my, um, what was my goalie's name? It was the rookie goalie from Anaheim. I can't remember his name, but uh, I can't bring him up, unfortunately. I tried everything I could, but uh, I have to wait till he's of age so I can bring him up. So I don't even know if I'm going to keep him. I might use him as a trading asset because this is only a five-year period. I might as well just go for an elite goalie. Um, so I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. I don't know if I should do like a full rebuild. Like I have no clue. I'm just stumped what to do at this point. Um just leave your comments, tell me what goalie I should go after, and uh, you think they'll fit good with my team. But 8-2-2 uh, two and two is not that bad, considering we are eh, we are kind of rebuilding. We have all our young guns up on the first line, trying to max out their potential. But uh, we're getting a lot of wins, so they're definitely going to go up by uh, year two. So Zach Bogosian with 8 assists, I'm liking that on the second line. Uh, Zetterberg's just going to town, man. Like I don't care how old Zetterberg's getting on, the guy's a beast. Guy is a beast, but I guarantee you we would definitely be winning a lot more games if uh, we had Datsuk and Kral most still in the lineup. But we have to rebuild, and um, but we're doing fine without them. We're doing really good actually. Um, wow! And sorry if you hear my phone in the back. I'll go turn that off. <laughs> oh, call him back later. Um, so yeah, I lost to Pittsburgh. I'm expecting that. But uh, if you guys haven't checked in my video already, I'll just take the time to uh, talk about this now. Uh, please go check out my new video. I believe it's um, my channel update. Uh, please go check it out. Tell me what you guys think because uh, I'm going to be adding more series to my channel. So if you guys would like to see a, a certain series, like a tips and tricks, something like that, please uh, feel free to leave your comments. But uh, we'll do some more simulation. We'll go to the we'll go to December 5th. Why not? Um, our team's doing really good, actually. 14-3-3. Three, and three. I'm liking it. Um, very good. And uh, Amateur Scout, I've reviewed this year's draft class. But in general, I felt it would be a good year for rookies. So, we'll stop right now. We'll put this simulation out. Um, There we go. Okay. We'll put this simulation out. What am I talking about? I'm trying to do, like, three things at once. I'm just... I'm mindfucked right now. I'm sorry, guys. But, uh, um put the simulation in what am i thinking uh where's the scout that's the word i was looking for um i can't even remember man oh it's too early for me right now uh scout assignment there we go there we go um forwards in the whl i want to scout hunter shinkarug that's what i want to go for if i can go for him that'd be amazing even though i gave up most of my picks this year so yeah shinkarug right there um we'll go Six weeks, and then I'll scout some defensemen uh, because we do need a couple more defensemen. I uh, wouldn't mind getting some top sixes. Top sixes go for a lot in this game, surprisingly. They go for, like, I don't even know, but their training value is a lot. It's uh, kind of shocked me. It's kind of weird, but whatever. Uh, Duchesne's doing some work, too. Look at that. 12 assists. Uh, lost to LA. The champs. It's not too good. Come on, let's get a win here. One more, one more. Come on, that's all I'm asking for. And oh, we get a loss, of course. <laughs> so we're 15 and nine, uh, including overtime losses. So I guess we're doing not that bad. But um, OT, we gotta change, gotta change our mentality. And there's another loss to the Avs. So Datsuk just uh, came back and just smacked us. <laughs> uh, that's what I get for trading him there. And we lose to Washington. So now we're in a slump now. <laughs> um, I thought we were gonna do a lot better. I did not know this was coming. Come on. Let's beat the Bruins. There we go. 3-2. to two. It might even be our... Yeah, it's probably our goalie in defense. Because I know we're scoring goals and we're getting assists and all that good stuff. But um, our D are coming up and they're going to be a lot better. We're definitely going to have two top twos by the end of um, year one. So um, the thing I want to fill out is the top fours. And um, maybe even my fourth line for forwards. Because... Uh, I want to make some big signings in the off season. Um, I was gonna go for Alexander Edler, but uh, since we have our defense kind of covered, I don't know what word to use there. But uh, I guess we're covered for defense wise. I don't know if I should go for Edler or maybe a, a superstar forward. Uh, so tell me what you guys think about that, and um, I'll just uh, review it. But let's take a look at this trade. We got a trade coming our way. 
So the Leafs third for this, um, Andreas Anthen, I don't even know how to pronounce his name, but that's actually not even that bad of a trade. Um, I'm guessing the Leafs won't be a good team this year, so you know what? Um, we can move up in the draft with it too. Uh, let's see if we could snag another pick, or should I even? I don't know. You know what? I'll take it. Why not? Um, that's actually not that bad of a trade. I want to see what place Toronto's in, see if it's a good pick. If not, I can use it to move up in the draft. But I think that was a pretty good trade. Um, let's see, how do I get there? There we go, okay. Team standing, so we're first in the Western. I'm liking that. Um, so we're second, um, just uh, falling behind Boston. Uh, New York could catch up to us, so that's pretty good. Uh, I just want to see where uh, the Leafs are. But um, yeah, it's not going to be that great of a pick. I thought they'd do a lot worse. But you know what, whatever. I wasn't going to use them anyways, and I really don't care about the Grand Rapid Griffins right now. So they're not doing that bad, I guess. But um, Well, they are, but... Uh, just for the lineups, considering I haven't changed them, they're not doing too bad. So let's do another. Let's go up to the All Star game uh, right here, and then we'll probably call her quits here because uh, I don't like uploading 20 minute videos. Um, TJ Brandon, let's take a look at this guy. Top minor, top two, 23 years old. Hmm. Huh. Uh, what's his contract? How do you how do you check that? Um. Oh, yeah, I'm guessing you can't. Mm. So use him as a training asset, use him as a top six, maybe. Because he definitely could uh, pass as a top six defenseman. You know what? He'll be placed in the minors. Why not? Why not? We can use him as a training asset if we don't need him. So I'm fine with that pickup. Oh, uh, come on. Let's get a couple more wins here. Oh, and a 5 nothing loss. <laughs> Jeez. That's uh, definitely not. Oh, 4-1. Um, we'll do a couple more games, and I want to take a look at the goalies, see what uh, goalies would fit my uh, team. Come on, get a win here. There we go. So we got a second phone for negotiations, so I like that. Um, looks like your second line's doing better, though, but it's obviously because of Zetterberg. If Zetterberg was up with Duchesne and Lanskog, uh, they'd be doing a lot better. So our scout's done. Um, we'll go let's take a look at defensemen, let's see if there's any good defensemen out there. Um, we'll go one month in the, looks like the WHL is the way to go this draft, so I'll go one month in WHL for defensemen, there we go. Um, let's go to, we'll end it here, I just want to take a look at the goalies real quick, and, um, I'll leave it off on a good note so I can, uh, ask you guys what you guys think about the goaltender situation. So, uh, yeah, it was Gibson, but I don't have him right now, I didn't make a move for him when I restarted. So, Gibson... Uh, let's, let me take a look at Jonas Hiller. He's an above average goalie. I know that. No, 82. Never mind. Howard's even better. But uh, I'm thinking of Hockey Ultimate Team standings. Uh, let's go. Andre Pavlik. No, thank you. Neuvereth. Or Neuvereth. I don't know how to pronounce it. But no, I'll pass on that too. I want to get a really good goalie, guys. I'm willing to give up um, a lot of picks for a really good goalie. Uh, so Corey Schneider, maybe. Uh, leave it up to you guys. I'm not getting Roberto the longer. Are you kidding me? Uh, so yeah, his potential is really good. He'll definitely be an elite goalie. Uh, so you know what? Corey Schneider's an option. Uh, why the hell am I even looking at the Leafs? I mean, no, I'm not getting a Leafs goalie. Are you kidding me? Hell no. No. Halak. No, thank you. No, thank you. Flurry. I'm not even going to try to make a move for. There's no way I'm getting Flurry. Mike Smith. No, thank you. The, mm. Nah. Nope. Lundquist, no way. I'd love to get Lundquist, but no can do. Broder, sorry. Rene can't. Price, I wish. <laughs> um. Jonathan Bernier. Um. He's a bat. No. Nah, no, nah, I'm not going for him. Let's see how much, uh, quick. Uh, no. I'd love to get quick. Oh my god. Yeah, if I could make a move for Quick, that would be amazing. Huh. Yeah, so Quick's, Quick and Corey Schneider are definitely uh, my two best options right now. So I'm guessing I probably won't get any better. Let's take a look at Markstrom, actually. He's probably not too bad. No, uh, he's a backup. Never mind. Um, no, I don't want Devin Dubnik. Uh, rookie goalies. Kari Lennon would be a good option. 
Yeah, definitely. I think Lennon's probably my best choice right now. So an A6 starting goalie it's definitely w will get better. Um, you'll probably be... Yeah, I'm going to go for Lennon next video. All right, boys. That's that's my choice. That's my choice. But I hope you guys enjoyed. I got the simulating going. Uh, we're 22, 9, and 5, so we're not doing too bad. But um, we're up to December uh, 2nd, and we'll probably get to the end of the All-Star game in the next video. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you boys later. Peace. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. Please go check out my past video. I believe it's my Hockey Ultimate Team Episode 8 or my channel update, something like that. Or even my subscriber shootout. But please go check it out anyways. All my files are like completely messed up, so forgive me. Uh, check out my surprise video as well. It's always there. And check the description for the links for my Twitch TV account. I'm going to be doing some live streams, so please go check that out. If you haven't already, please subscribe at the top right-hand corner. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And once again, feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe, boys. And I'll see you later. Peace.